Hello everyone, UK here. In today's video, we are going to be taking a look at every cosmetic item in the full triumphant cosmetic set. A massive thank you to everyone that has clicked the subscribe button. Only a few days ago, this channel hit 500 subs, so thank you very much for the support. If you'd like to support this channel further, please click the subscribe button. Now, let's get into the video. The triumphant set, including equipment, clothing, weapons, and ships that were introduced in Sea of Thieves on November 20th that released alongside the Seabound Soul update. This update included a number of brand new commendations for players to earn by killing players with specific weapons and even playing 200 games while using pieces of the glorious ship set in return unlocking pieces of the newly released triumphant ship set. First on the list is equipment. Here we have the banjo, the bucket, compass, Concertina, the drum, hurdy gurdy, the lantern, the pocket watch, shovel, speaking trumpet, spyglass, and finally the tankard. Onto clothing, the triumphant set is made up of the hat, gloves, coat, dress, belt, trousers and shoes along with the vanity items, eye patch, hook and peg leg. Wearing these items in the arena will let all facing crews know that you have quite a bit experience in the arena. Now we have triumphant weapons. By killing 100 players with each corresponding glorious sea dog weapon, you will unlock the triumphant sea dog weapons. Here we have the cutlass, the pistol, Acquired by getting 100 kills with the Glorious Sea Dog Pistol. The Blunderbuss. Unlocked by getting 100 kills with the Glorious Sea Dog Blunderbuss. And finally, the Triumphant Sniper Rifle. Unlocked by getting 100 kills with the Glorious Sniper Rifle. Let me know down in the comments what is your favorite Triumphant Weapon cosmetic. Moving on to the ship set. By completing specific tasks using the pieces of the Glorious ship set, you can start unlocking pieces of the Triumphant ship set. But beware, as completing this ship set requires quite a bit of grinding, as the hull is unlocked by playing 200 games while using the glorious ship set pieces. If you don't have the glorious ship set pieces but friends do, ask them to put the full glorious set on before arena games. This will help speed up your progress early on in your arena grind. And now a look at the full triumphant ship set on all three ship types. And last but not least, the Triumphant Sea Dog title. Acquiring this title is a sign of some of the most experienced players in Arena, and it can even force some opponents to leave Arena lobbies, as you will appear as a fierce opponent. But sometimes appearances can be deceiving, if you know what I mean. Well, that's it for this video. I hope some of you guys decide to step in the Arena, whether it's for fun with friends, grinding 240 wins, and even completing the Triumphant Sea Dog set. Remember, if you enjoy my content, please click that subscribe button. I'm trying to hit 1,000 subscribers on this channel, so all your support goes a long way. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.